And I remember that, that sheer willpower coming over me, thinking, I'm not going to miss the next train, whatever happens. And so there I was, sort of pushing my way to the front and barging my way through, and I got onto that train. Of course, not knowing that I was boarding the train at exactly the same time, in exactly the same car carriage as a suicide bomber. Um, and I was running late for work, something again I never ever did. And I remember just standing there squeezed next to so many people and thinking, why doesn't the driver just close the doors and why can't we just take off because I'm already late, I'm chairing a meeting, people are depending on me. Um, and that sort of sense of, come on, come on, come on, come on, and then the doors close. And it was really just a matter of, I felt seconds, it could have been a minute or so, leaving King's Cross Station. And it really was just, there's no bang, there's no anything, it's just, it's the difference between a sudden change of night or day.